this. Oh, sorry, I'm gonna bump my leg. Straight out to PS2, here we go. Oh, wow. <laughs> All right, uh, and we start off, uh, major neutral. Ooh, Gons with the, uh, down throw up there. Yeah. Was early. Yeah, he's really good at that. Yeah. I feel like most would just opt for the Nair strings, but, uh, yeah. Uh, and just chasing after, Phantom chasing after Gons with those Nair strings. It's like, you're gonna get hit with this eventually, whether it's for, like, 3% or the full thing. Phantom not letting Gons off this ledge. Uh, finally, he gets off. Nares his way out. Now back to the center stage, neutral. Nope. Yeah. Like, just sort of feeling each other out right now, dash dancing, not really committing to anything hard. Yeah. I feel like that's the Palumira in general. You don't want to commit. Yeah, you really don't, and it's not really, not really that you don't want to. Is that really can't because a lot of her like committal stuff like just isn't worth it. And yeah. Other than like maybe a smash attack reach. Like, you're really not going to throw out her tilt to neutral. Like, you know what I mean? You're going to space with fair, back air, dash dance, yeah. mix and grab. Pressure. Yeah, nair pressure. I just feel like because of the way her nair works, that, like, even in the ditto, it's kind of just like, all right. Oh, oh goodness. goodness. Oh, back there, and that's going to seal it. Misses the down air and gets punished for his troubles. Yeah. So, Gon takes an early lead, 97%. I feel like for middleweight characters like Palu, or on the lighter side, like this percent is kind of perfect to start off. Get a lot of easy percent. It's hard to kill because your opponent doesn't have rage. Ooh, that's that's an interesting uh, way to get out of that. The fact that um, he just teleported to the other side of the stadium and the other Palutena couldn't like actually hit him. Yeah, probably the ledge cancel, uh, edge cancel on the platform. No, he just landed. And oh, no he shield. just landed. It doesn't have her teleport on like when you land doesn't have a lot of lag. Oh, that's good to know. <laughs> yeah. I personally don't like this matchup simply because like my character's so big I can't help but not get hit with this. Yeah. <laughs> no matter what I do, oh my lord. The Nair train never stop. Oh my goodness. Uh, oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, get used to it. I, we had to see this with Gen, uh, Gen vs. Can... Frozen oh. earlier, and now we're getting a run back here. Oh, Tri State has too many Palutena's. I say that as a Palutena player. I mean, but at least you played her at four, but yeah. Nah, it's not even about that. There's just too many. True. Nice explosive flame, forcing jumps. I feel like that's the thing. I feel like Gons wants to uh, force jumps and then try to get close enough for a reverse back air punish on landings. Yeah. Nera, nice jump there. Alright, Nera. Now what's gonna be the offstage punish? Ooh, fair. Oh, no punish on the explosive flame. Felt like it was just off it. Ooh, oh, parry, nice but scary. nothing. Parry into nothing. Felt like he didn't come in. Oh, oh, that's really smart. Yeah, that up smash. The last, the like, almost like the end hitbox yeah, was just enough it, to catch the get up. It lasts forever, so it's very good for catching jump and neutral get up. No longer get up attack because those are fully invincible. Uh, right. Now how's Phantom gonna get out of this corner? Yeah. Managed to get out now. If he could dance, ooh, that, that might Tom be. Yeah. yeah. Even wow, this is pretty even. Uh, going into uh, going into final stock yeah. simulation. Phantom taking a slight lead. With his uh, great less traffic. Oh, misses the grab, and that's going to open up Gons yeah. to get these combos. Yeah, and he even hit right back up. Yeah, the, the and good he's still thing going because he, he uses air dodge. Yeah, that's a, like, Gons is, like, super good with that combo. And it's very good because it sends you, like, the it ends with you being above Palutena. Yeah. And I feel like that's where she's most threatening, where she can threaten you with another nair, another up air, or back air. Yeah, and just not letting Phantom get back on stage to reset his jumps. Oh, did the nair too early now. Yeah. All right, now it's Phantom's turn to uh, trap this man. He lands, so he yeah. still got the jump. Oh, nair, I was expecting an up air, but... All right, it's not too bad, not too bad. Back to the center stage. Ooh! Ooh. The actually, wind hitbox yeah, actually... The Made it safe. Oh. Oh! Fana oh, messed yeah. up his recovery. He knows it. Yeah, he knows. Uh, palm on face. The instant classic when you know you messed up your execution. Mm. No, stage man probably don't matter that much. Just honestly, just personal preference. Yeah. At this point, I feel like as long as like they're just going to keep repeating PS2. Yeah. It's either that or someone has a preference for Smashville, <laughs> as I say that. Yeah, I, I, I like to say it's a lot as Palutena. 
Yeah. It's it very good to. Um, she, just, she just had like, like one string. You're like already off stage. Yeah. That and it's just very easy to dance around that middle platform. Yeah. The middle platform is great for like being able to ledge cancel stuff. Yeah. Whereas where other characters would struggle trying to approach because that middle platform is just like a nuisance in landings, I feel like Paolo doesn't have that issue. So in the neutral in the mirror, it's basically going to be like whoever gets the first neutral hit is going to dictate the pace of that set of that stock, and then it just resets. So right now, 69%, 82 real quick, and Phantom has not landed on stage. Back to the edge. All right, finally he lands on stage for once. Uh, uh, this is the grab against the forward air. It really looks like Gonzalez knows how to like maximize the damage he gets per his hits. Yeah, that's that's something. Whereas gone. Phantom, yeah, whereas Phantom is really like he's getting he's getting stuff, but he isn't maximizing. Yeah, yeah. Gonz has always had an amazing punish game, even if it's not with his neck. Ooh. Yeah. Gon it's seems to also have the timing down for catching the teleport with a. Uh, Neutral air. Yeah, that's yeah. it. Can't be, can't be whiffing like that in front of a, a yeah. player of Gonza's caliber. He's just going to grab you and uh, chuck you off for that stuff. Yeah. Now, now, Palo's Nair really isn't like an approach option. It's more of a get off me and just yeah, pressure get off. tool. And like if you see they already committed to something and like, oh, my button's going to beat your button. Yeah. I just Nair and I can start a combo. Oh, Ooh, okay. he man, he went for a hard read. Yeah. Personally, I would have preferred just something safer and guaranteed. But I mean, sometimes you gotta make the big plays to try to get back on, st uh, back in this game. Because he cannot exactly. be taking, he can't be taking any more percent. Ooh. Oh, there it is. Yeah. And Gon's just like he kind of just drifted into it. Like I'm just gonna land it back air. Yeah. Like, he that's a that's a pretty bad habit for Palutena's. Like. Yeah, they keep thinking, oh, my shield is inv eh, it's yeah. invincible. I, I can beat out anything, and then you just get smacked in the face. Yeah. And See, that's the difference between ending a combo like with Gon does with up air and, and ending with fair. Like, yeah, he only got 40, he only got 45, and didn't really put him. He put him at the ledge, but then he got off of the ledge. Yeah. Like Gon's gonna put you in the air, and then put you on the ledge. You know what I mean? Yeah, he would have he would have uh, forced your resources out earlier. Exactly. I think that's the main difference between uh, Gon's and Phantom right now. Like, Phantom has to expend more resources. He has to expend his air dodges, his second jump. Or, ooh, ooh, what a walk of three. If there's one thing that Phantom is doing that's keeping in this game, he's getting these very uh, big boy reads. It's just yeah. these aggressive reads that's just calling out Gonzalez. It's his options. Oh, nice drift around the... Whereas Gonzalez is going, is going the slow and steady route. He's like... Ooh, Ooh, he went up to avoid that. Yeah. Oh, misses oh, the down till the... Uh, you can't really commit to something hard there just when you're a back throw kill percent. Yeah. It just feels... At that point, he's like, he had the lead where he got it, and he's like, all right, should be good. Ooh, Gon's trying to bait something out, but... Yeah. Uh, I feel like Phantom finally learned not to expend any of his resources. He just uses DI drift to get out of combos. Yeah. He was doing that, too, to get around explosive flames. Ooh, okay, he's, nah, he's yeah. All right, now what's the get up? Oh, oh, I thought he was gonna nair again. I, like, I would have done it, seeing as Gonzalez's shield was going down. Yeah, he might have shield poked. Yeah, even if it doesn't shield poke, I would have just been like, all right, force this man to keep doing something and just see like, all right, now it's your turn. You have no shield. How are you going to uh, handle this oh, pressure? Like and it looks like Phantom is uh, definitely getting the, uh, the better end of these neutral exchanges. Nice back oh, air, tried yeah. to trade, and yep. Trade. Definitely feel like that fair kind of messed up uh, the beginning of his DAI. So he wasn't able to uh, survive that where he probably could have. It was just a trade hit. Yeah, I see what you mean. Banning Battlefield, interesting. Oh, <laughs> I was like, Port Arrow Town Drive? Uh... Yeah, best of five. <laughs> yeah, cool. Because like Phantom's like awesome. Yeah, yeah, they're in they're in semis. This is top eight. Alright. What after the heck? Alright, after this match. Alright, sorry about that folks. Alright, so we as we get into it, uh again. Auto radicals. I feel like in Smash 4 that auto radical thing happened, but with back air. Like <laughs> you would both just short hop in place in back air, and then nothing would happen. 
ain't trying to commit. That's the name of the game. Yeah, that's especially not in this mirror. Yeah, honestly, this mirror can, yeah. A lot of mirrors go very one-sided because you both have the exact same tool, so it's basically just an in, uh, initial timings. Nice anti-air with the up, uh, up tilt. Back here, sends him across the stage. Auto Ooh, radical again, like another that. back here. I like that jump in from Gun. Oh, he tries to uh, air dodge his way to the edge. I love those explosive flames because they. And cause, back uh, Phantom's forced to drift out, and then Gun is able to like force him to go low because of that, and then he, he can makes time. It, yeah, it makes it more to, linear to punish. Yeah, his he, can, get up. he can time the nair to uh, beat that out. And pop aboard the nair train! Yeah, 48%. So now we keep going. Yeah, uh, Gonchis does so much more damage per opening. Like, this all started because he got like a Nair combo starter at zero. Yeah. And it's still not ending. Gon is in complete control this stock. Oh, uh, good mix up though. He definitely was expecting him yeah. more to go for a, a ledge cancel on that uh, platform. So going up really threw him off. Oh, How okay. hard is Reed? Phantom is just like, you're going to drop shield or rocker. Yeah, Phantom definitely like wanted to pull the trigger more uh, like earlier than Gons, but like. Yeah, nah, you can't. You, sooner or later, Gons will, will catch up to you. Yeah. Uh, it looked like last game. Yeah. Like, Except that, this, new game, yeah. new Gons. Yeah, new game. Can't land without it. Yeah, you can't. You can't, you can't uh, do the same thing to Gons when he's Bro. in new Gons Plus. Gons, <laughs> new Gons Plus, I love it. <laughs> oh, the grab. I thought he was going to go for a back air, but I guess he doesn't want to steal it. Yeah, it's actually really smart not to steal back air at that point. Forward air. Yeah, now he's going like to try fishing for it. Now that, now that he's over 100, now he's going to try fishing for the back air. Nice air dodge. Back throw. He should be fine. Mm, yeah. Yeah. Careful, though. Uh, barely misses. Uh, if he had gotten that, it would have been a good spark of life. Yeah. I, I respect going for it. What? Oh, okay. Oh, he's fine. Oh, no. Yeah, he's uh, still fine. You okay? Yeah, there's some. Sometimes yeah. the hitboxes don't connect, and like the little small ones send you sideways for some reason. Yeah, yeah it's just probably a weird hitbox interaction with the explosive flame. Yeah, Phantom really is desperate to try anything. Oh my goodness, how did that not kill Don? Probably not far enough off the edge. And that's gonna do it. Three stock, and. Ooh. Felt like Gons was about to get up, and then he remembered, oh, snap, best of, best of five. Yeah, yeah, exactly. <laughs> All right, so Battlefield ban again. I'm guessing he's doing it just to cut off Phantom's uh, recovery options. And going oh. back to Smashville. Yeah, going back. Yeah. Because really, like, what are Phantom's options? He can't go to FD because that makes it even less likely for him to land, and he's already having trouble yeah, landing like against Gons. Yeah, exactly. PS1, PS2 is the same thing, and Town and City, I don't know if he's comfortable uh, with the uh, removal. Well, it's kind of the same thing, because it becomes FD. Yeah, at some point. It's at some point. And Paladina really doesn't have too much problem covering those platforms. He can definitely, like, double jump up there to, like, yeah. safely pressure from below. Right, it looks like Phantom is uh, hitting a new gear, as he's not taking a single hit this entire first stock, and... Oh, missed oh, the, the cross-up. Yeah, so the very this. baby cross-up. He thought he was right on the edge, but... No, you still get those awkward cross-ups. Ah, nice fast fall back here. Auto to force him off of there. Oh, good punish with the fair. Landing back here. Forces that jump. Oh, Ooh, weird nice. auto reticle from John. Not really a movie you see to get used to get out of the corner. Ooh, yeah. great up tilt. Low profiling in that forward air out of shield from John. Yeah, and it keeps him high in the air so he can chase after him. Yeah. Ooh, Dash Attack's going to do it. And I feel like he wasn't ready to DI that. Yeah, I, I always felt like Palutena's up tilt was an underrated move in Smash 4. And I still think that too. There are probably some situations where you might like Throw the back air and they already air dodged up or something. Yeah. And then you can just up tilt their landing and then reset the situation. I feel like it's the the thought process is more of a why do it when you can just nair out a shield. Yeah. For better results. Oh <laughs> wow. He didn't even let the nair finish and he just immediately challenged it. 
Nice. Yeah, up see, like right there, yeah. up tilt was like the only thing that would have hit it, hit his landing. And we got an even game. Yeah, only 20% on gone, so there's not a lot of a. Uh... Yeah, he's caught back up, and he's gonna take the lead. And he's gonna do that up there, and another one. Uh, this time, um, Phantom able to land this time, not taking too much percent from, uh, from after Gonz's combo. Oh, okay. I guess that's the game we're going to play today. Yeah, we're, we're just playing. We're going to all... Nair, boys. Get on board the Ooh. Nair train. Ooh. Nice wait on the spot dodge to punish with the fair. Down throw fair. Mm. Bailey misses it. Oh, oh he, he, drifted, he drifted way too far to the right. You got to believe on those hits sometimes. Oh, he won. They both went for dash attack. Gons was a little quicker on the trigger. Grab. Wait for the spot air dodge. Gets in there. I definitely feel like Gons does not want to, like, waste too much time. Oh, back air uh, dash attack trade. Yeah, I think, neither, um, play, neither player are worse for wear. Yeah. Oh, nice. that's, yeah, that's super risky. That, that's that's, a, that's very, a hard commit. He's like, yeah. you're going to not shield this. And honestly, the reward wouldn't be worth it. Gons would not have died at 110 from a dash attack. Yeah. I feel like definitely, like, both these players are great, but Gons is edging out simply in just assessing risk-reward. You don't yeah. really see a lot of risky options from Gons. Whereas Phantom feels like he needs to play more aggressive and more uh, out there to get those kills. A nice back air. Yeah, catching normal get up. Yeah. Now we're on a last stock situation. This could be Phantom's uh, last stock in the winner's bracket. Ah, oh, he let go shield early. Hate to see that happen. There, train. Hope you got your Metro card. He gets out of it. All right, back throw. Oh, Gon's kind of like, like he made it out of that situation. But oh like my those, goodness. The win box stage, basically like saved them from not getting punished by a back air. Yeah. Uh, nice anti up, up tilt. Yeah, yeah. more Palazinos should do that more often when yeah, they know good. when they know they've already exhausted their uh, opponent's options. Yeah, and like Nair's not gonna work right now. I gotta up tilt to catch their landing above me. Yo, Phantom finding a way through those projectiles, able to land a clean hit. Oh, oh my goodness! Oh my what God. is this? Should have grabbed. Win box shenanigans. Should have grabbed this man. Oh, yo, if he let it go, bro, bro. if he let it go a second earlier, Gon's yeah, would have ran into it or jumped into it. He would have gotten clipped by the underneath. Nice. Oh, get nice. up attack. Back throw. Tom Hong back throw. Too far off. Oh, jeez. Yeah, he was slightly. Oh, yeah, yeah. He read it. He's not going to kill yet. Gon's is like. And the last hit is not. Oh, oh my lord! I th that was a super close set. Yeah, but Gons is like the master, like baiting you to roll into his grab range for the um, for like the back throw. All right, and I'm gonna have to uh, go off onto my redemption bracket match. Okay. So, uh, hopefully, we got another commentator. Yeah.